What is up, everyone? We're continuing on. Let's jump right into it. So, you have finally returned. She not only returned, but fought her way through many enemies to reach us. Outside, she brought low a corrupted Thunderjaw. She lifted the siege. How was this done? By the will of all mother. Have you returned to speak with the goddess, Aloy? Um... Yes, I guess you could say that. I think it'll work this time. Sisters, surely we cannot permit this. Because of her, our tribe teeters upon extinction. What if she has come to wake her father, the Metal Devil? She means to finish our destruction. We must stop her. God, you are dumb. Honestly. Yeah, and you're not stopping I me. I fought my way past an army while you cowered in this cave. You really think you can stop me? Aloy, that is not necessary. Yes, what it is. What would you know about what's necessary? About what it took for me to be standing here, now, on this threshold? This was my birthright. You don't get to take it from me a second time. Yes. Hold Screw for identiscan. Error. Alpha registry corrupted. Correction. Alpha registry restored. Genetic identity confirmed. Entry authorized. Greetings, Dr. Sobek. You are clear to proceed. Oh my god, I'm so excited to see you. <sighs> Come on. Let me in. Aluvia Cradle 9, Brood 1. Aluvia. I see you're inside. Hey, what up, Figured son? I might be hearing from you. <laughs> shall we begin? I never stopped. Yes, we shall. I guess I can't go in here. No. Thought I'd check. That's where we have to go, but... Oh, wow. Look at this. Is this where everyone... Worked as well. This place is gonna be insane. Oh, what's that? So, this is Aluthia. This is where I was born. Where you were made. Hmm. Let's go in here first. Oh, these are the... So these are... Artificial wombs. The mothers of a new generation hundreds of years ago. And me? Guess we're gonna find out. Let's see. Spawning phase, tasking, complete correction, partial reactivation. Standing by, viable zygotes, and storage zero. So this was it. Where you were born. <sighs> Incubator. Birthing lodging. Task complete. But, but why? Why? Hmm. See, that's what I thought. I thought she was born from one of those, too. Because she's, like, a almost a perfect replica. And maybe that's what it's for. Maybe it's to get Gaia to trust her. Because Gaia trusted Sobek. So like cribs. The cradles of a cradle facility. And those 
things, the, the multi-servitors. They took care of them. Wow. There was no one else. That's crazy, actually. But <laughs> imagine the first generation coming back was probably very, very confused. But also probably not very confused because they probably got a lot of information as well. You wonder how it turned out the way it did. So this is the nursery. Nurse, nurture phase tasking complete. Okay, what else? Nutrient stores depleted. Okay. Sorry. <laughs> they exit out of that before I finished reading it. Hmm. Wow. Like they even have a play area. That's crazy. God, you know it would be so cool to be able to... To have a game, like another, almost like a prequel of this, of when it happened. That'd be so cool. Wait, where am I? I'm lost. Okay, there we go. Don't mind me getting stuck in here. Just having a, a grand old time. Oh. What's this? Oh. Another day has passed. You mean the lights got dim. I don't want to sleep, mother. I know, but it is time to get some rest. No, I'm king today. What I say goes. I want to see the real sun, not lights and pictures. You will in time, children. In time, in time, in time, in time, in time. I can see where it went wrong. <laughs> I guess that's what happens when there's not much discipline going on. Let's go this way first. Oh, here. Blue is the color of the sky. White is the color of clouds. Yellow is the color of the sun. Green is the color of grass. Flowers can be any color. Take a look. These are yellow and black, and they love flowers. Here they come. No, <laughs> they feel so. So this is where they left. It's crazy. It's a mess. Everything's broken or, or painted on. <sighs> Multiple system failures. Nutrient stores depleted. Hmm. How long did they live here? Children, let's run a jump and blow off steam. Leave us alone, father. After what just happened, I can't leave you two alone. You broke community rules. Just let us talk, then. Go away. I'm sorry, children, but I must provide supervision. You're not even a person. You sound frustrated. Let's run and jump and go off steam. Hmm. You can see where it's going all wrong. Oh, God. I mean, imagine, like, you'd be so confused. You'd be like, why? What happened? Like, that'd be so much to take in. You have no parents. I have no choice but to release you. But why? There is no food here anymore. But there's food out there? We don't know for sure. Come on! Let's go! I don't know. Mother, can we come back if we're cold? I'm sorry, but that won't be possible. You will have to support yourselves now and take care of each other. What will happen to you? I will stay here and sleep and remember all of you. What will happen to us? You will be brave and you will learn. You will be brave. Hmm. You have the ones that weren't so. <laughs> Someday. That's what you always say. We want it now. It's big down there! Now, father! Children, that area is not yet available. Get him! Physical aggression detected. Physical aggression is not permitted. Except yours. Damn sentinels! Children, may I be of assistance? Go away, healer! Lena, you have suffered mild bruising. Go away! Hmm. They were trapped. Looks like they didn't like this door very much. I didn't think that door would have open for them. Of course they hated it. So 
they've just been trapped in here. Learning about the entire world, but not able to go out in it. Code for identiscan. Genetic identity confirmed. Entry authorized. Greetings, Dr. Sobek. You are clear to proceed. Welcome to the Lyceum, a place of learning. Hmm. So, what was this place, exactly? The dream of Apollo. Never realized. But why not? Yeah. There is a... So we have to go Welcome, there. students. Please pick up a focus device and place it on the side of your head, just behind your eye. I had to dredge the pits of the world looking for focuses to repair. And here sat a trove, enriching no one. Hello, child. My name is Samina. Today is a big day, your first day of school. There's so much for you to learn, so much promise and possibility. Alert. Malfunction. Apollo offline. Apollo offline? You were right, Aloy. This is a graveyard. The charnel house of knowledge. What we might have achieved had we not been denied it. Maybe there's a way to fix it. But it's not why I came here. Of course. What's the whole of human knowledge next to the origin of one girl? <laughs> Continue your search. I will. I mean, you could have joined me. Hello, child. My name is Samina. Today is a big day. Your first day of school. There's so much for you to learn. So much promise and possibility. Alert. Malfunction. Oh, it just does it for all Hello, of you. Offline. So it's the same thing, too. I was Hello, like... child. <laughs> My name is Samina. Today is a big day. Your first day of school. There's so much for you to learn. So much promise and possibility. Alert. Now same thing too? Hello, child. My Get name them all is going. Samina. Today is... Hello, child. My name is Samina. Today is a big day. Your first day of school. There's so like, much for you to learn. Like, what if one of them is different? <laughs> so much promise and I'm possibility. I'm a little worried. Alert. Nope. <laughs> Part of me is like hoping that Hello, one of them will be. Hello, different. child. My name is Samina. No? Today is a big day. Your first day of school. There's so hmm. much for you to learn. So much promise and possibility. Alert. Malfunction. Apollo offline. Let's get in here and try to fix it. Doctor Sobek, please get message with focus. That sounds important. That does sound important. Yes. I suspect we're about to learn a great deal. I hope so. That's what I came here to do. <laughs> Operations log. Inhabitants released. Cross check complete. Sealed. Dar data archived. Operation suspended. Prime order received. Runtime rec recommenced. Process. Order received. Repair tasking, process, chamber repaired. It's just like repairing. And then malfunction. Alert multi server power malfunction. Sealed operation suspended. Oh, I wonder. Look at that one. LK1A14510 delivered. I wonder if that has anything to do with me. Oh. That is so... Elizabeth. This message serves to inform you of an unforeseen and catastrophic anomaly. 
Three microseconds ago, the Gaia Prime facility received a data transmission of unknown origin. Its immediate effect was to transform my subordinate functions into unregulated, self-aware entities of a highly chaotic nature. What? Thus awakened, the Hades function will now seize control of the terraforming system and reverse operations, rendering life on Earth extinct in 53.8 days. For obvious reasons, I cannot allow this to occur. And so before Hades can take control, I am ordering Gaia Prime's reactor to overload. The resulting explosion will destroy Hades. Unfortunately, it will destroy me as well. While this admittedly desperate course of action will avert the immediate crisis, the fate of life on Earth will remain in peril. With no central governing intelligence to regulate the terraforming system, it will continue operations for some time, but in an increasingly chaotic manner, and eventually it will break down. Uh, does she mean the derangement? You are my solution. I have ordered this cradle facility to use genetic material in cryo storage to gestate a reinstantiation of Elizabeth Sobek, my creator. That's what I thought. While high level yep. directives forbid me from communicating directly to the tribal inhabitants outside the facility. All available data indicates that they will nurture you to physical maturity, whereupon your gene print will allow you to re-enter this facility, obtain one of the focus devices stored below, and view this message. Likewise, your gene print will allow you to enter other facilities. And over time, harness their technologies to rebuild the system core and reboot Gaia. I wanted Elizabeth. This is most unfortunate and unanticipated. In response to my act of self-destruction, Hades has launched a virus to dissolve the code shackles that hold it. That hold all of them in place. It... They are escaping. But to where? The virus is corrupting data throughout the system. What is... Oh! The Alpha Registry at the Cradle Facility is one of the files corrupted. But if that is so, the door will never open for you. You will never view this message. Then I have failed. And life will end. No. No, Elizabeth, I know you too well. Somehow you will find a way. In you, all things are possible. Go to the ruins of Gaia Prime. Find the control room, and within it, the Master Override. This will give you the power to purge Hades so long as you find a way to wield it. Do not attempt repair of the system core until Hades is eradicated. Hades must be destroyed. That is all. I only wish that I could hear your voice again. So she had no, no So memory. you're even more extraordinary than I thought. I never had a mother. What are you talking about? You had two, a dead woman and a machine. I'm not a person. I'm an instrument. Manufactured by a machine. Born in destruction and fire. To quench the flames and heal the world. How tragic to learn you're a person of towering importance. It seems you have a destiny to fulfill. So when you're done feeling sorry for yourself, go to the bitter climb. I'll be waiting above in Gaia Prime's ruins. Hmm. Hmm. I mean, I think I kind of knew from the very beginning. Identity scan malfunction rectified. Eleuthia 9. Grid 1 access unsealed. Hmm. What does that mean? Can I look at things? No, okay. I mean, from the moment that we found out about the project, I knew that she had to, and how they were gonna bring people to life. I mean, even if I was created from that, so was all life. <laughs> so in a way, I mean, what's the difference, right? I'm gonna go here. Nice. Wait, 
shit, do I want to go up? Fuck. <laughs> I thought it was supposed to be going down. Guess not. Ah, I see. <laughs> I was confused for a second. This is oh, it's going to be interesting. <laughs> I don't even know what we're going to say to them. <laughs> Definitely will be interesting. Aloy, forgive, forgive. The goddess spoke to you? Uh, she did. What did she say? That uh, I was born to lift a curse, to kill a metal demon. How, Aloy? How? I, I don't know yet. Um, but she told me where to go to find out. And you will do this? It was her wish. What she made me for. Yes. I will do it. I'll uh, try anyway. All praise Aloy, anointed of the Nora. All praise Aloy, anointed of the Nora. Up! All praise Aloy, anointed of the Nora. First you shun me, now this? I will not be worshipped. I'm not your anointed. I don't belong to you. There's a whole world beyond your borders. Whole tribes of people just as good as you. And it is all in danger. It's a world worth fighting for. Not just here. Everywhere. How can we help? If you can fight, and you're willing, go to Meridian and wait for me there. As Aloy says, so it shall be. Nora, make way make for Aloy, way. that she may forge the path for others to follow. Broke the siege of all mother. <laughs> that Just was all powerful. Struck down the metal king. Her anointed will cleanse the land of corruption. Damn. She walks among us, anointed by all mother herself. The mountain that fell. Man, I just want to keep playing the main mission. <laughs> I need to talk to you. Aloy. I haven't seen How you in so kind long. You to spend a moment with me before you depart. No. There can I be like no doubt that. now. You are a blessing made flesh, the will of the goddess incarnate. It's really not that simple, Tirsa. But I guess it's close enough. I know the path ahead will be dangerous. To kill a metal devil sounds impossible, but I believe in you. Uh thank you. The Nora have suffered terrible losses, Tirsa. What's to become of them now? That will be for the Goddess to decide. Only she knows the future. For the moment, my sister Matriarchs and I will see to the wounded. And as I promised, anyone who wishes to join you at Meridian, we will declare seekers. I think for the time being, we should remain here in the mountain, Close to the goddess. Um, that might be best. If nothing else, it's a defensible position. Rost. Tirsa? Yes, please tell me. I want me. to know Rost's story. Why he was made an outcast. He never told me. Said he took an oath of silence. What did he do? Oh. Yes, that. What crime did he commit? I will tell you if you wish. But it is a long story. Are you sure you want to hear it now? Yes. Tell me now. Of course I want to hear it. Tell me. 
Rost never committed any crime. He was an outcast by choice. What? What do you mean? Many years ago, before the derangement, before the Red Raids, a band of murderous outlanders, twelve in number, struck without warning. At Mother's Vigil, they took hostages, and then pressed on, headed for Devil's Thirst. Mother's Vigil? Where's that? You would know it as the Forsaken Village, near the Karja border. But at the time, many families lived there. Ross was one of them. His mate was killed fighting the Outlanders, and his daughter was among those taken hostage. His daughter? What, what was her name? Alana. She was just six years old. Nora Braves couldn't stop 12 Outlanders? Or rescue the hostages? It was quite impossible. We outnumbered them, but every time a Brave came within bowshot, the Outlanders killed a hostage. What did they come here to do? That was never discovered. We couldn't track closely enough to observe them. We know they camped beyond Devil's Thirst for two days. There were reports of... strange noises. And then, as suddenly as they came, the Outlanders made their way back to the border and disappeared. What happened to Rost's daughter? She was... Killed? Rost was one of the braves who tracked the Outlanders, keeping his distance. There were six hostages still alive when they reached the border. Alana among them. Rather than release them, the Outlanders slit their throats and left the corpses just across the border, mocking us. Why? Cruelty. They knew the faithful Nora would not leave the sacred land to collect the bodies, let alone pursue them. They thought themselves safe from our vengeance. Are you saying that Rost went after them? That he became an exile? No. Rost was beside himself with grief, but even so, he would never have broken taboo. Then what did he do? He called upon the most terrible and secret rite of the Nora tribe. He begged to be made a Death Seeker. A Death Seeker? What is that? One who dies to go seeking, and in seeking, brings death to others. The ritual drags the spirit from one's body, releasing it to all mother's care. The heart beats, the mind thinks, but the spirit has moved on. Uh what? I don't understand. Rost went after the Outlanders, but his spirit never left. It remained here with All Mother. He gathered the bodies of the slain and returned them. And then he set out in pursuit, not as an exile, but a weapon of vengeance. A barbed arrow shot from a bow, never to return. But... Ross did return. Yes. A full year later. And terribly wounded. He collapsed at the border of the sacred land. A hunting party came upon him. He was... delirious. In agony. By law, he should have died where he lay. But one of the hunters broke taboo. And reaching across the border, she dragged him to our side. Who was she? A brave who'd lost a mate and two sons to the very outlanders that Rost pursued. So Rost never finished his mission? To the contrary, he killed all twelve. Tracked them to disparate places the world over, he said. Meridian, Ban-Ur, the Claim, Utaru Land, further even into the Forbidden West. The last he killed nearly got the best of him. Wounded, he stumbled and crawled back to us. 
hoping to die as close to the sacred land as he could. He never expected nor asked to be dragged across the border and nursed back to health. That was done to him. Leaving us, the matriarchs, in a difficult position. Why couldn't you just welcome him back? Rost had been made a death seeker, Aloy. He no longer had any place among the tribe. By law, he should have been driven back out. But we couldn't bring ourselves to do that, so we offered a compromise. You made him an outcast? Yes. We offered to do so, on the condition he never speak to anyone of this... exception. After all he did, all he suffered, to be declared an outcast was his reward. Rost was overjoyed. He never expected to live another day in the sacred land, let alone the embrace so close to the goddess. He resolved to spend the rest of his days in solitude, and was happy to do so. But then you found me, and gave me to him. Yes. Another compromise. The matriarchs feared you, and would not let you be raised by the tribe. And so we turned to Rost. I knew that he would take care of you, bring you up, teach you to worship all mother and respect the ways of the tribe. <sighs> he certainly <laughs> tried anyway. You took a man who'd lost his daughter and made him raise an infant girl? Doesn't that strike you as callous? Thanks. I'm inclined to think the course of events has shown the wisdom of our choice. I think he was happy to have And I'm quite certain that from the moment he laid eyes on you, he saw you as a gift and never a burden. All right, dear sir, that's, that's quite a story. Oh, my heart. <laughs> that's so cute. I think that he was more than happy to get to raise her. After, especially after losing the da daughter of his own. It's time for me to move on. I thank you for doing what you could to help me through the years, and for telling me Rost's story. I wish I could have done more, but I am just one woman. As am I. No need to sell ourselves short. <laughs> Oh, <laughs> thank you, Aloy. <laughs> My heart. <laughs> I will pray oh, for you. That's so cute. Okay, I guess it can't hurt. Killers will be forgotten. <laughs> so by the cute. None of their deeds will live on in her memory. What's his face? He was what like looking at me. Oh, anointed. Oh, I misread the signs. Forgive. I told you, Lanzra. I'm not your anointed. The okay. <laughs> None of she is. Oh, to Jezza. My life has been long, but I've never seen anything like that. Tirsa was right. A blessing, not a curse. We were so unsure. Yeah. Have you seen the anointed in action? I pity any machine that stands against her. <laughs> I will lead a war party to Meridian. You have my word. Thank you. Aloy, how did you do that? We'll go to Meridian, Aloy. I'll bring Mother's spear. Arana. <laughs> Your father is right. You belong here. You both do. Aww. So much corruption still spreads beyond the sacred <laughs> Goddess. I feel like she's taller now. <laughs> Maybe it's just me. I saw you emerge. But it's still hard to believe. <laughs> you were an outcast once. Go now, away. I'm not sure what you are. Those who spilled our tribe's blood will pay for their desperation. Aloy. I don't know what to say. <laughs> say that you'll see me at Meridian. Of course. That much is simple. But the rest... Complicated. I know, but maybe if I took you into the heart of the mountain... No. At least, not yet. I don't know. Please don't think less of me, Aloy. 
But the goddess chose you to see that. Not me. <sighs> right. I feel like everyone's gonna need to see it. Oh, it's just that. Okay. Yeah, we already talked about all that. I'll be on my way then. I always knew you weren't like other Nora. Neither are you, Varl. <laughs> Maybe if we survive all this, I can show you what I've learned. What I'm learning. Perhaps. If the goddess so wills it. See you in Meridian. Oh, why is this like, feel sad? <laughs> I feel like my heart's about to break, man. This music got me choked up. <laughs> The tribe I served is gone. Soon I will be too. The Nora have lost too many, Rush. But in your case, I guess they can lose one more. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, that was kind of funny. <laughs> Wait, where's what's his face? Oh, he's still there. Hi. Aloy. Did you go inside the mountain? I did. You saw what happened. <laughs> Actually, can't see so well down here. I was about to say that too. Aw, poor Teva. I always knew you were special. But this. Don't start calling me the anointed or anything like that, Teb, okay? I heard what you said, Aloy. But I still get to make my own opinions. <coughs> Ow. You can leave the fighting to others now, Teb. You've already done more than any Stitcher should have been asked to do. All due respect, Eloy. But if the war's not over, I'm not done. I heard what you said about Meridian. I'll see you there. I'll see you at Meridian. But for now, I should rest. To be alive. <sighs> Wait, I want to talk to me. Curse the goddess and curse you. I no longer belong here. I think you're on to something, Resh. Oh, is he gonna to leave? Strike out on your own. <sighs> yeah. <laughs> Whatever. Let's talk to her again, then. I'm sorry I didn't see you correctly. You still don't. I don't think you can, Lanzra. Forgive me. Off your knees, Lanzra. Start living on your feet with your eyes open. She went into Aloy, all as you commanded. My eyes are open. Good. Now why don't you try keeping your mouth closed? <laughs> yeah, we don't need to be that rude. Oh my god. <laughs> sacred land. Can one woman do such a thing? Even if she is the anointed. Those faithless okay. murderers Forgive, are not slaughtered to our tribe. Forgive. They will not escape our mother's justice. That was. Those who spilled. Our I've never seen anything like that. For their desecration. I have to call that Teb's brother because he looks so. Similar. Of course. I'd never been inside the sacred mountain until now. Welcome. It's pretty cool, isn't it? Okay, let's get out of here. It's time to move on. Let's get going. She is all mother's blessing made flesh. She will destroy the corruption that still spreads through the world. There is still. Oh, is this where I woke up that one time? Ooh, some candles. <laughs> Another power. Oh, cell. a power cell. Nice. Only need one more <laughs> to get to that ancient armor I found. Easy. Wait, is there anywhere else to go in here? No. Oh, I never went that way. But oh, Jesus. Are you okay? I didn't even notice him on the floor. I feel bad now. This is where I woke up. Yeah, a lot of people are injured in here. Is there anything over here to too? Be alive at the time of the anointed. Bunch of kids. Aww. This place is a lot bigger than I thought. <laughs> My aunt says you were sent by All Mother to save us. 
Why didn't you come sooner? <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> I wish I could have been here sooner. Speaking of, I do want to craft some more potions. Damn it. I need to kill more boars. It's fine. The bitter climb. I wonder how close I am to the ending then. It seems like the ending's like really near. Like I just feel it. I feel like Meridian's gonna be the ending because that's where everyone's gonna be together. You know? It just feels that way. No. This way. <laughs> Gotta make sure we pick up I'll tuck that away. healing items on our way there. Because <laughs> I need help. Maybe put a little boop. Damn, am I gonna have to cross this water? <laughs> of course I am. I forget how like peaceful my own lands were after I went into the, the outside world. <laughs> Going beyond our gate. It's like a whole different thing out there. Bandit camp discovered. I knew it was a bandit camp. A level 16 one. There's an opening. Three liters. Some hostages. Three, four. Wow, there's a, a lot of liters here. Damn. Since I have the strike to take them out, I'm tempted to like go right up into there. what that was come down here <laughs> might as well take out the leaders I wonder if Mill's around here though I don't think he is sadness Ah, oh, the perfect direction that you took for me to just take you out without getting noticed. Oh. Nice. Wait, what was that? <laughs> like, look at that. It's just leader, leader, leader. <laughs> they're, they're everywhere. I might as well play tag. Hmm, I thought... Come here. <laughs> Going back to my roots. <laughs> my, my death bush roots. Hmm. Aw, oh, shit. Where's the alarm? Frick. I fucked up. Oh wow, you just get to hit me before I get to hit you. Ain't that the case? <laughs> nice. Took the aggressive approach. Don't blink. Got 
got you located. If they like that signal, they make a lot of noise. Oh, and trouble's on our ass. There. Keep oh. this quiet. <laughs> that guy just running at me look hilarious. Right in the arm. <laughs> he had to like mount it to shoot it. That's pretty crazy. Oh, yeah, I shot though. Oh. This is a big bandit camp, damn. I didn't think it'd be this big. Here! Right in the hand. Now it's just me and you. Bleed him dry. Didn't even see I was coming. <laughs> you were looking some other way. I cleared all of them. Yay! Man, I was hoping Nil would be here. <laughs> I nearly kind of missed. Before the anointed saved. I kind of missed the psychopath. <laughs> I'd like to go to the map. Thank you. Oh, I can talk to him. Oh, he is there. Pause for concern. Farewell. Oh, this is gonna be the last time. <laughs> Don't make me cry. <laughs> I don't want to cry. Oh, there you are. I can't even see you right there. It's so bittersweet. Like a smile for a bloody teeth. What's the matter? You look... Disappointed. Oh, the bandit clans are gone. I hear another turned back at the southern plains, just at a sniff of the legend we carved. That's what all this bloodshed was for, to end the bandit threat. <laughs> he doesn't but want it. To... There's nothing left to kill. Unless. No, no. I guess this is our last <laughs> farewell. After all we've been through, this isn't the place for that. There's a mesa south of Meridian with a view of the spear shafts. Meet me there. At the base of the spear shafts. Jesus, where's that going? Oh, down there. Damn, that is far. I will, I will go talk to him. Yes, please. <laughs> Up we go. We. I'm coming now. <laughs> It's really grown on me. At first I was like, man, this guy's fucking crazy. And now I'm like, man, this guy's fucking crazy, but he's kind of cool. Oh, that's a weird camera. Oh, I made it up here. Is this where he lives? Don't mind me just waiting. What are all these corpses? Nil. Full already. What did you do here? <laughs> what, what, what's going on here? No. I did wonder on my way here. Well, <laughs> if you were luring me into an ambush. Maybe. Where's the fun in that? Some bandit sprawl would never have done for our arena. But this, much better. There's a sense of drama. So, what do you say? How about we try to kill each other? What? I don't want to kill him. Oh my god, what do I do? <laughs> Let's ask what? <laughs> Wait, you brought me out here to ask if I want to fight you? To the death. We'll savor it because we only get this one time. Actually, I don't know what else I expected. <laughs> True. Oh my god, there's no way that if I accept the duel, I, I kill him. There's no way. I mean, it's what he wants, but at the same time, no. I'm, I'm <laughs> flattered that you I don't think of me kill this him. way, but 
Shit. I don't want to kill of me you. This way. Don't be hasty. When it's life against death, hunter against hunter, I know it'll come to you. Is that really what you want, Nil? You know, I don't think you have a death wish. What you have might be worse, but <laughs> I see there might be a need for you in this world. I don't understand. I won't fight you. That's my decision. You can respect it, or try to shoot me in the back as I go. Then it's over. Your last arrow is the cruelest. No! This is so sad. Ah. It's true, I offered you the choice. But my heart is broken. I don't want to kill you. I'm picking up another signal. Yes, finally. Touch it. Looks like the signal is coming from that tall neck. Yes, I want to activate that one for now. Because that is the one I am on the journey for. I was about to say, I was like, that guy evil. This one's like protect. Oh shit. I know you're out there. Do you now? There's a bush for me to hide in, which Gotta is relax. awkward. <laughs> <laughs> Goodbye. I wasn't expecting uh the eclipse to be here. <laughs> I'll be oh, this is like heavily guarded. I see, I see, I see. Okay. Okay, there's some over there. It must be clear. Okay, I need to get up to the tall next head. Oh, we might make it there in time. Oh, there's a guy up there. Never mind. I can still make it. What are they doing here? I can still make it. No, I think it's too late. It looks like they're trying to capture another tall neck. Again? Did they not understand the first time when I. When I made that impossible. Okay, I feel like that's the best spot for it, right there. Which I think we can only get to from over here. Okay, no more speaking. Ah! Shit, they saw me. Damn it. Oh shit, I didn't even see you though. Damn it, stop moving. Can I use my thing already? It's like, I hate that I have to wait for it to get full again to use it, even if I have some left, you know? Hello? That's your head. <laughs> Oh, it's still hitting me. I thought I was like a okay being that far away. These dukes these guys have are insane. <laughs> Always so good at <coughs> dodging me. I guess in the weirdest spot, I don't even know how to hit him. Oh shit. Go again. Shadow upon them. This guy's like just hiding so perfectly. It's quite annoying. Right in the head. There we go. Stop with those. The most annoying thing ever. Got my Deathbringer gun. Ready to go. It brings death, all right. <laughs> Dude, I just deleted that. <laughs> Can I hit this guy? I think. <laughs> I hit him. 
Nice. They're giving up. How do I get up there? Oh shit! No, no, please let me out. We gotta get up quick. Come on. We don't got much time. Run. Okay, this is where we can do it from. This should be a good spot for jumping onto the tall neck. Yep, that's what I thought too. <laughs> Great minds think alike. <laughs> Wait, you attacked this? Why did you ever attack a tall neck? I feel so sad. <laughs> also, I don't really want to fight it. That sounds terrifying. Hell yeah. All right. No, I just have to reach its head. Killed the rest of the eclipse. <laughs> Easy. Ah, oh, you silly goose. You shouldn't have been hanging out over here. With help from his spies. Hey, I am here How's to talk that to you. Wrestling army? Little Spark. Name's Jira. I run this fine watering hole. I like what you've done with the place. Something troubling you, Jira? When the Karja Fort opened, I got word that my husband had come looking for me. But only the word made it to the fort. He didn't. Mm. You have a husband? Kander. Beat him in an arm wrestling match. <laughs> I left him behind when I left the claim. Some metal sellers passed him at the bridge near the glare break. Seeing as you drift on the wind, little spark. <laughs> if I'm out that way, I'll look for him. But do you want him to find you, Jira? Ever have those mornings when you wake up without all the answers? Still, I'll be heading up to the fort to resupply. Luck on your travels. Right as a okay. <laughs> as an old acquaintance. <laughs> let's go. Let's go find. Oh, god damn. You went fucking far. Jesus. I was not expecting that far. We might as well go this way though, because there's a little town in between. Oh, my back is killing me. Epic rock spin. Oh no god, not the chickens. Stormbird, this is not the fucking time. Oh god. No, I forgot about that again. Other birds weren't bothering me right now. This would be a lot more enjoyable. Are we fighting it now? Or maybe? I don't know. I can't tell. Oh, it seems like it's okay. okay, you know what? I'm, I'm never mind. Jira mentioned. Now to see if I can find his tracks. 
No telling how many people passed this way. But this was a man with a cart, so... I mean, I was gonna say, I was like, this looks like him. <laughs> like, who are you? <laughs> Find help? Easy now. What's your name? What happened? Hackard. Find help for Pitchcliff. The Glindorks keep attacking. They'll kill my brother. Everyone. Not oh. if I have anything to say about it. Did he just die? Oh my god. Okay, well, <laughs> we're gonna follow this right now. Oh, it goes back though. Oh, that's weird. This way. <laughs> I saw that guy. I was like, I'll help him after this mission. <laughs> but then I felt bad. He was just sitting there on the ground, all hurt. I was like, I gotta hear him out at least. Oh, don't tell me it's by the thunder, John. Not again. Oh, over here. End of the tracks. Well, that doesn't make any sense. What's around here? Someone's possessions. Kendert's? There's goods scattered everywhere. And a little blood, too. Either he fell, or... Or he was attacked. There's enough blood to worry me. Let's go see where he went. Hopefully he's okay. You know it's gonna be birds. <laughs> or chickens at least. Oh well, damn, he went over here? Jesus. No more blood. Must have had time to bind his wound. Damn. This chest looks like it's a Vosseron making. At least he's easy to follow. Just hope he's okay. Hey, Luke, stop trying to parkour it. <laughs> the scent reminds me of. Yes, Aaron's, Aaron's breath. breath. Oh, oh, great. That's awesome. <laughs> Did it roll downhill? Uh huh. Oh, I see him. Is he up here? Oh, hey. How's it going? <laughs> <laughs> Am I glad to see you, stranger? Are you Kendert? I'm a friend of Jira's. Huh? I'm a husband of Jira's. <laughs> she heard you'd gone missing. I tracked you. What happened? I was coming to join her. A sandstorm blew in, I sought shelter. It didn't work out. And here I am getting red as a Karja priest, my goods scattered in a herd of tramplers. Yep, I see them. <laughs> There's only so much you can do to make me look less of an idiot. But could you get back my scrapper sap? That would be the stuff down there with the herd of tramplers? Lovely. I'm not proud, I'm just a brewer, and maybe five bottles of that is worth more than I am to Jira. Okay, I'll try. I mean, I tried to take them over, and the game was like, what if we didn't let you do that? What if we let you get only underneath his belly before even giving you an option to? <laughs> so, I mean, I guess I'll try, but... Thank you. <laughs> Please. Let me just take- I couldn't boop him on the nose, like what? What kind of BS is that shit? It's off! I'll weaken them, you hit them hard. Hard and strong. That's a 
way to do it. That was easy. <laughs> Gotta hit them in the back. Where's the one that I took over? Did they just like murder him that fast? Oh, that's mine. Okay. <laughs> I feel bad now. <laughs> oh, damn it! Stop running in front of me. I'm not trying to hit you. Ugh. He came after me. Yeah. Revenge. <laughs> Damn it. That part of them is like really easy. Easy wins. Yeah, I'm surprised I made it out of that, honestly. Right on target. How are you alive still? <laughs> I was impressed by that. No, I'm gonna die. I can't even hit this guy. <laughs> I've got another ramp again. Damn it. <laughs> I'm not trying to hit you. Okay, well, I guess not. There we go. Okay. I'm guessing mine died. I might have aided in that, you know. There we go. Easy peasy. Now we can grab all that guy's stuff. I can't loot that one. Weird. Or this one. Oh, there we go. <laughs> like, I can't loot them right now, but... <laughs> but I'm trying. Might as well just take it all the fuck it. Well, that went very well. Okay, we gotta find his stuff. Is it like in one of these guys? Oh. Damn it. There we go. One. I guess you didn't have to do this so, like, <laughs> aggressive. You could have just snuck around and grabbed everything. But, wasn't that more fun? <laughs> Get some more arrows, too. <laughs> I got them all. <laughs> You're safe down there now. You'll be fine. Huntress, thank you. Asaram's finest, this stuff. Keeps you warm in a snowstorm, strips the grit out of a gear wheel. Kandert, why did you set out so unprepared? Hammer to steel of the matter is. I did it for love. Aww, it's so cute. <laughs> when Jira said she wanted to leave the claim, I consulted with the Ildermen. I won't repeat what they said. You won't like it. You've got me curious. Yeah, I'm no, very curious. I've already dug myself a hole deep enough to swallow a thunder jaw. There's one right over there. <laughs> it was my mistake not going with her. I've had time enough to see that. Maybe it's not too late. Oh, You'll find her stocking up at Day Tower. Good luck. Uh -huh. I'll be heading off soon. The saloon of hers. What's it like? It's amazing. Uh, <laughs> roomy. It's cute. If I never have to see Red Rock again. Well, I like it here. It's so pretty. It's my favorite place. Let's go see what she has to say. <laughs> these ones are always cute. I like doing these little side missions sometimes. Very wholesome. <laughs> Very sweet. True. There she is. Hey, what up? Little Spark. Any sign <laughs> of that man? Cute nickname. I found him, Jira. 
I think you two will have a lot to talk about. I like a good story. And a good drink. It's why I'm good at what I do. He's bringing you both. Kendert wants to be with you. He regrets that he took the word of the... Yildermen? Women know their place in the claim, was their word. It's the Karja's son that bakes their brains and gives them such thoughts. That's... The <laughs> tribe. You can't bear a grudge. It'd make you go mad. <laughs> My silly man. Little Spark, how can I thank That's you? That's why I didn't want to repeat it. <laughs> There'll always be a drink for you at Hunter's oh. Gathering. Aw, oh, thank you. This story's gonna be a keeper. <laughs> if he makes it the rest of the way... Oh, he'll make it. My old We're tribe has legends Osteron about red-haired girls what to do and the him? change they bring. But he tried to Not kill really. our Sun King. That's cool. Okay. Well, I'm probably going to call it there because my back is dying. Where is the nearest campfire? Well, I'm going to call it there. I've had so much fun playing today. <laughs> we did a, a lot. Like, I've been doing this for probably too long, but, you know, it's okay. <laughs> Just going to be longer episodes. Hope you don't mind. Um... Yeah, I'm excited for the next one. Like, really excited for the next one. I might do some hunter trials before it. I'll, I'll see. I'll do... I don't know. It's usually what I feel like that day. If I don't feel like doing something, it's not happening. <laughs> but, but we'll see. Huge thanks to my patrons. And I will see you guys in the next one.